archaeologists have unearthed two exceptional temples in the historic ancient city of Posidonia Paestum, a settlement in Magna Graecia on the southern coast of Italy. Constructed in the Doric style, the temples have been unearthed in the western sector of this important ancient settlement near the city walls and situated just a short distance from the sea. Well-preserved architectural remains at Paestum, originally Posidonia, but renamed by the Romans, is situated on the western coast of southern Italy in the province of Salerno Campania. It held significance as a vital settlement in Magna Graecia, a term the Romans used for the coastal regions of southern Italy, populated by Greek speakers since the 8th century BC. Founded around 600 BC by Cyberus settlers, Posidonia flourished for two centuries before falling under the control of the Lucanians, an Italic tribe around 400 BC. Later, in 273 BC, the Romans conquered the city, renaming it Pestum, continuity of worship across empires. Dating back to the early 5th century BC, one of the recently discovered temples at the Pestum archaeological site includes remarkably well-preserved architectural remnants, particularly the stylobate, a stepped platform supporting the columns that upheld the temple roof. The stylobate, measuring 11.5 x 7.6 meters, 37 in 5 x 24, 6 feet, exhibits distinct features, including the four-sided peristatic columns encircling the inner sanctuary referred to as the cella. Traditionally, the cella served as a sacred space housing a cult image or statue representing the specific deity venerated in the temple. These exceptional discoveries, which add new fundamental pieces to the reconstruction of the archaic history of the Magno-Greek colony of Posidonia, document the multiple construction phases of a sanctuary located in a liminal area near the coast from which the settlers themselves had come a few decades earlier and built in the archaic era, even before the city had a defensive circuit, explained the director of the archaeological park of Paestum and Velia Tiziana D'Angelo in a press release. Behind the temple, the investigation unearthed the remnants of the internal vestment of the city walls, revealing a collapse that had impacted the temple, resulting in partial destruction. Below this collapsed structure, archaeologists identified the layout of a beaten road running parallel to the temple, displaying a different orientation than the surrounding walls. This finding indicates that by the end of the 6th century BC, when the oldest temple was built, the city of Posidonia did not yet have defensive walls. During a period characterized by substantial growth and monumentalization of the polis, the settlers of Posidonia strategically erected a sanctuary in a prominent location, serving as a protective focal point for the urban space and visible from the sea. The significance of this sacred space is underscored by the enduring and continuous use for over five centuries. It points to the fundamental continuity of worship, spanning the Greek Lucan and Roman periods, attesting to the enduring cultural and religious importance of Posidonia. Pestum, a vitally significant settlement in Magna Graecia. The archaeological site of Pestum gained renown for its exceptional preservation of three ancient Greek temples built between approximately 550 and 450 BC. They were constructed in the Doric order, an early classical architectural style, and dedicated to the Olympians Hera, Athena, and Poseidon. Showcasing the cultural and religious practices of the ancient inhabitants of Poseidonia, the site's temples are an important draw for visitors even today.
The recent discoveries confirm there is still a lot to do in Paestum in terms of excavations, research, and also in terms of valorization, Gennaro San Giuliano, Italy's culture minister, said in the release. The Ministry of Culture explains that this latest archaeological find holds significance in broadening our understanding of the ancient settlement's dynamics and the evolution of Doric architecture in Posidonia and Magna Graecia as a whole, in particular understanding Paestum's layout in this context, reports Archaea News. D'Angelo described these findings as crucial evidence, emphasizing their importance in reconstructing the ancient history of Posidonia.